boy. Hmm. Hello, my name is Tommy Takemoto, and I'm the owner of Animal Lovers Pet Shop. This store was developed with lots of love, and we made many friends, and animals tend to do that. Uh, I was working as a manager of accounting department, and after a while, all the numbers seemed to be the same. So I got bored with it, and I start looking. And I've always loved animals. So we went looking for properties for boarding animals, and that was a little too pricey for us. So we found this small pet shop on Calle Mayor and PCH, and we fell in love with it, so we purchased the store. And that's the beginning of Animal Lovers Pet Shop. We are now entering our baby department. And I will introduce you to babies that are still being fed manually. These babies are called Eclectus parrot. Okay, they are about seven years old and they are still being hand fed. Okay? Yeah, come here, baby. See you you can't do this unless they are hand fed. And that's what we try to emphasize. So the people come to look for the bird they can actually hold it without being bitten. You want a cat? These are called cockatiel. And these are all being hand fed. And this is the, the beauty of hand feeding. They don't bite you. And they love the company. So we actually specialize in hand feeding. That, that's a beautiful white turkey. So you don't find these unless you specialize. Oh goodness, oh yes, yes. Mwah. I know you're hungry. Yes, I know, I know, I know. Okay, okay, okay. All right. There you go. I'll be back. I'll be back. It's been over 30 years since we've developed this store. And luckily, this shopping center just opened up about five years ago. Our old pet shop was falling apart, so we decided to venture out to this new horizon and I think we made the right decision. Uh, the people around us is very friendly, helpful, and we found many new customers just by moving one large long block. And we developed a little bird department. We made a reptile department and small animal and we keep adding and I like to introduce everyone this is our bird room come on in here is our bird room hi Tiki hi Tiki this is Boo Boo, this is Spanky, and they're called Bear Eye Cockatoo, and they're over 30 years old. Okay, and these are babies, baby Senegal. Yeah, it's a happy sign. And we had a little accident, so 
we've got a band-aid on. Yeah. But we're doing just fine. Huh, aren't we? Yeah. It's gonna look like this one when he grows up. Okay. Our customer comes up to the counter with whatever merchandise they're buying. These bearded dragon thinks that they're gonna feed them. So they all gather up and it's almost like a praying. But they're kind of, it's kind of neat. This is our reptile department. Uh, we have all the necessary equipment, containers, supplies, food, and we also have the tank that you require for your reptiles. And we also have beautiful snakes and lizards. And this is our uh, biggest, his name is Samson, and it's a uh, uh, Domero Boa. It's very friendly, and Mr. Frog. This is our supply room. We have bird seed, treats, baby food, and if we don't have it, we will order them for you. Just let us know. And this is used for cages. There's a special purchase made out of cloth. This is for them to sleep in. And these are the purchase, cloth purchase, rather than wood purchase. And birds seem to like that because it's more gentle to their feet. Every bird requires entertainment. They're very similar to human babies. They need to be busy or they'll start hurting themselves because they get bored, they'll start pulling their feathers. And in order to avoid that, we recommend things. They need intelligent toys, not just toys. They need to be able to think and play. We always recommend our customers to use a carrier when they bring to and from home. Um, people think that it's kind of cute to have them on their shoulders, and that's how you lose your bird. Cages for smaller birds, and you can tell by the size of the cage and now you can come to these solid metal cages are for big birds like the macaws amazon cockatoos and then some of these are smaller you can tell by the the size of the uh, metal these you can put cockatiels parakeets lovebirds that smaller group this is our boarding room. Whenever the parents have to leave their birds, this is where they come and we take care of them. And they're safe. And at least they are being checked every day, fed. So this is their fun room for them. Okay, hi sweetie. Oh, yeah. Baby? Yeah, she got here late, huh? Right. If you find that you will be leaving for your vacation or emergency, you can always bring your birds to us. We do have the boarding facilities and we will take good care of them until you return. We welcome your pets. Good night.